booting. Audio capture. Okay, E4 is happening, and I am calm. I'm hours late, and I'm still the first one here. Of course. Come on. No, I do not wish to calibrate the motion control camera. Yeah, you do. This is the backstage machine. Yes. I need the audio so I can, uh, think aloud. This is our demo machine. This is our fastest box. Any day now. Welcome back, Coda. Time to demo. You made it. Hours. Well done. You are the most hardcore fans on the forums. I risk giving you early access keys because we need to work fast. You know the plan. Think of the man Starfather used to be. Make the demo good enough to fool him. Oh. Good. Now sign off and get in line. I need you in your seats. Koda! You did all this yourself? <laughs> you might get us best of show. Uh, you know, in the script I've been calling the Messiah maybe a son. Now I'm thinking, daughter. <laughs> I'll see you at E4. Yep, just drive fast, okay? I have to start letting the crowd in over here. Where is my phone? Hello? Hey, yes. Connect me to security at the keynote auditorium, please. <laughs> so, still crazy. the God's little show is about making this world seem real, as long as you look but don't touch. But I know them. When they con that crowd out of yet more cash, they will get cold feet and start all over again. I'll be stuck here till the stars die. But... But... If we can monkey wrench their demo from the inside, shame them in public, the crowd might demand a new boss. Hint, hint. <laughs> Even a joke deserves an ending, right? Their big pitch to the press and all of their fans is on in five. Oh, those specific here comes the end. guests are to receive the VIP seats I specified. Press can sit with everyone else. Thank you. Okay. Let's see here. What do we got? Okay, one last test. Ish and Maze walk down the hall, blah blah blah, applause. He asks Maze for her fake baby, and then I just hit this. And every fan in the crowd bears witness to the complete game that was stolen from them. Toggle, toggle. Okay, ready. Huh. Hey. Hey, no, what's that IT guy is an idiot. No, 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 no. Why can't I move? Now it's moving on its own? Who's controlling yes. this? Coda. Having some drubs? The demo machine. It's... I, I'm not doing this. Yeah, dang. That's just... Crazy pants, Coda. D did you try turning on the motion control camera? Oh? You think it has to register the sword? Fine. Maze, what did you do? The controls won't respond. Ready, Coda? Or should I call what? you Star Daughter? Ew, no, withdrawn. No way. Oh, listen to them. E4, the great Hydra is upon us. Now, Coda, you'll be back here on that demo machine in case anything goes wrong, right? Coda, something I need to know? No. Maze? No. Remember, Maze, play nice out there or I make the speech. And Coda retains your brand rights. Such a douche. So, you wanted to show the world the old sci-fi look, then what? Pass out pitchforks? The stolen world was the ideal setting, but we can lose it if we must. You're the story, Maze. You say you stand for all players, but look, at least one has their own ideas, and now it's their turn. Maze, please. An imaginary friend. You were good once, near perfect. But we've run the theory craft on every possible state of play, okay? We are the fan community, and you gave us nothing Register but time. Control. Now we could abuse your brand, ruin your name, but we want to redeem you. Just play along, and when Ish asks for your fake baby to become the next star father, look him in the eye and put it to the sword. We've all heard him practicing the speech. He'll quit in disgust and pass on the magic circle to me. 
to us. Coda, come on. The game industry straight up knifes a baby for PR? You say you're a fan, but this will kill the game. Maybe all games. I never say this crap, but for real, do you even <laughs> play? Honey, when this is over, I will teach you my game. But I don't oh, think you would like it. Shoot. It takes such a long time to play, and in the end, everyone wins. I know you're there, whoever you are. She doesn't see you as a threat. Thing is, if I get to that baby, and it's my only option, just don't make me take it. Looks like this demo starts with a hero. Not you, boss. A fake hero, walking through a castle to meet his royal baby. The intern wants her lady boss to murder that baby, live, on stage. But if the crowd sees that, I guarantee that this world gets shut down. And me with it. So, I'm gonna hide out in that baby's head to make sure it survives. You've come this baby. far to help me. You'll find another way to bring the house down, right? Well, hello, B4 crowd. My old nemesis, again. After these shows, one of you always asks, what is the magic circle? It's an old idea. I draw a line around any given space, call it round demo under. And inside it, we agree on new rules of behavior for the fun of it. The result we call a game. Is there any other stuff? Turns out it's harder than it sounds. I know how long you've waited. Some of Can't you have been fans since the text adventure. But everything ends. Even Star Fox. Oh, you like that? Okay, code over for this Make it easy, procedural baby nonsense you know. of yours. Our demo was about the But it's true. This demonstration is about legacy. I never had kids, you know. Okay. I was convinced I couldn't give up the magic circle to anyone new. How could anyone understand it like I do? Let's see what this one has to say. Until I met Coda Solis. Oh, you know her? Honestly, I wasn't expecting that. But she's the one who helped me finish this game. Thanks Baby. to her, your Baby long movements. wait is over. Uh, and we're about to prove flight. it to you. Am I assistant here, Actions or should I say, the infamous Maze Evelyn? Firebush. Uh, hi. I'm supposed to say that even though the latest Specials. game tracker failed, if you like what you see here today, Group think. then we urge you to help fund the project Jamie's. on our page at Patronize. And now, Demo <laughs> I get to hero? shut up. Because everyone knows the hero doesn't. Allies are... Maze will be taking on the role of a male hero tonight for the purpose of our little story. Nothing. She spent hours playing the magic circle, and the game has rewarded her with a child. That's right, a daughter born entirely of Maze's choices in the world of the circle. No other experience oh. offers a child <laughs> who learns from you as this one does, unscripted and dynamically generated by our proprietary system. It inherits all we know about her, about you, as a player. Let's get started, shall we? Into character. Hero, are you ready to make good our pact? Not but I was born, your child I didn't think this game could stars. blow my mind anymore and training. until sure. I got to E4. let's get this over with. Oh my goodness, this is so crazy. And let us make haste to your wife's chamber. Oh. I can still control it down here. Okay. Ah, uh, that, uh, didn't know we were showing up combat on that maze. But that's how you know that we're unscripted here, ladies and gents. <laughs> uh, hero. Perhaps you should slay any more of those we encounter. There seem to be traitors in your midst. And we cannot risk the life of the babe. We arrive, hero. When this act is done, the world of the circle will never be the same. Oh man, they ready? killed all of them. Not really, but this is me, heroically walking. 
face. What the hell? <laughs> Stop this! <laughs> Stop laughing! Listen, this wasn't supposed to happen. This isn't my story. Look at Stop all the flames. It. Don't you understand? This is not a comedy. This is my life's work. You don't care about any of this, do you? You're just here to leer at a train wreck. Who did this? I saw that whole thing from the baby's eye view. Oh, evil baby. <laughs> I haven't laughed in 15 years. Thank you. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Coda, you? Why kill my baby other than to hurt me? I told you, your work is the great love of my life. I love it so much, I'm going to save it from you. Okay, Coda, that's enough. Call security? They think this is all just another PR stunt. But please, allow me. Coda? Are you threatening me with a toy laser beam? This is not a toy. This is a limited edition, molded resin Securitron figurine with inbuilt laser sight. You gave it to me when I was six. Don't remember? Best day of my life, till now. You handed one to each of us after we waited in line for days to see the Magic Circle's first gameplay demo. You know, the one set in space, which no one ever got to play. Incidentally, many of those same forever. people waited in line to be here today. <laughs> As you said, the object I'm aiming at your heart is just a novelty collectible. But Ish, look. It's dark out there, in the crowd. How much are you willing to bet that all your fans are so harmless? Coda, the old man is scared of you now. Happy? Make your demands. This is an open letter from all of us. Lord Starfather, we will always love and remember you. We will take care to do your character justice. Ishmael Gilder, you failed us for 20 years. We have access to your sequel script, and right now there exist five dozen superior works of fan fiction. We now do a better job of writing like classic you than you do. We want the magic circle made public domain. Let us finish the game and release it for free. We are your fans. For 20 years we supported you. We believed in you. And we deserved better. Now get the fuck out of our way. <laughs> I see. At last the player has spoken. Very well. The second I step off this stage, the magic circle is yours. All of you. Maze, Coda, and you. Yes, you. Whoever you are behind that screen, I know what you are now. You are control itself. Does he you are that weird? which plays us all. I can feel you there, hovering over the button to silence me forever. And why? Because we convinced you of your God-given right to do it. Well, what are you waiting for? Staying here means listening to an old man shout, Doom! And don't you need to get back to your story? Push it. I dare you. No? Uh, well, then call it. this your moment of clarity. Because control is your opiate, my friend. And we got you hooked. Strung you out on the stuff of your entire waking lives. Maybe you think it matters what you play. No! Be it the gritty reboot of Cops and Robbers, or the pansexual mystery hour, it was we who offered it. A guilt-free alternative to all the gray and fathomless contours of the real goddamn world. Oh, we tell ourselves we're letting you seek meaning on your terms, via the sublime grammar of experience. Where's going? For decades we shouted games, goddammit! When the soul speaks, it is not stated, it is lived! But in truth, we just want an excuse to peddle a tame reality. A universe you can bring to heal. 
We tell you that, yes, you are the chosen one. Yes, you can achieve a perfect ratio of wins to losses. Yes, any problem of any scale can be solved with enough cash, time, energy. Any imbalance of power can be ushered into final equilibrium. And above all that, oh. the world needs you to do it. You, to shepherd us to that ideal and optimal and ultimate endgame, the win which justifies all you have lost to reach it. Even now, you don't see me. All you see is the latest time trial, the next puzzle challenge, the final boss. But it was I who tempted you to take control, and now you have. So I lost the right to be shocked when over 20 years I announced some trivial change to my life's work and you sent death threats to my door. What right do I have to cry foul now when you rise up as one Is that his goal? to simply his solve me? Everyone out of existence? So what now? Should I say you win? Congratulations. When at last you push that goddamn button and seize control of my story, someone will sell you the next. The time we've stolen will never now. be recovered. Code has given that up. That void in you, which was meant to contain your life on Earth, remains. And that's it. It's over. They've all filed out. It's just you, me, and the invisible wall. Well then, you're in charge now. Push the button. Which button? Fill in the blanks. Kill the feeds. What do I do next? Push the button. Which button? Tell us how it all ends. Push the button. All right, I'll hit escape. Come on, this is euthanasia now. Just hit that goddamn button. I hit it. You want me to beg? Fine. I beg you. Whole story, bro. Achievement. So that's what a god's last breath sounds oh my like. <laughs> SOB has some lungs on him. His kind have always been scared of you, boss. Couldn't accept that this world was never about him. Don't let him shake you. He's wanted to make that speech for years. Quitting was the only real decision he ever made. Hear this, Coda. How do I turn on the echo? Right, here we are. Hear this, Coda, and your so-called fan community. As of now, the Magic Circle is open source. Anyone who wishes to contribute to its development may enter and do so. But before I go, I have a new game for you. The rules are easy to learn, for they are an exact mirror of reality. The electric bill strikes in less than one week from today. It pays for those servers, without which our tools just don't work. So, unless one of you generates a playable experience by then, and sells that game for enough to pay that bill, it all goes dark, kids. The first person to ship a game wins, and will retain creative approval on all future titles. See, there's always a sequel. You will, in effect, have my job. I would say have fun with that, but I think you've had quite enough. Coda, all yours. Let. Them. In! He did it. He quit the world. I'm the closest thing he'll ever have to a kid, and he never knew I was a... What's that? Welcome. Welcome, friends, to the Magic Circle. Now, I know Starfather's conditions may seem daunting at first, but a short timeline was always part of our playbook on the forums. We have our own script, we have a focused feature set, and a massive team. Together, we can do this. I know the tools. Let me guide you to the full realization of our vision before we have to pay that bill. No! No, don't you see? We've oh, already won! Hand? There's no contest! You don't have to compete! That's what he wants! Can't you see? Damn it, stop playing around! You don't understand! It's not just oh. a game anymore! It's not just a game! <laughs> Oh, wow. 
boss, you heard him. At least some piece of this world has to get finished and sent out in order for me to escape. And these freaks wouldn't trust them to finish a sentence. Gotta be you. Get out of here. Find a safe place to build. Alright, where are we going? Oh, I don't know where I'm to go. I'm going back to where we met. Find me there. Oh, try to do this with one frame per second. There's only it's... one way out. Shut it all down. Yep. How do I shut it down? If you're not going to make a move, I will. I can't move. Well... With all that going on in the overworld, this is the only safe place left. So, you know I want out. But I also wanted you to build something of your own, which meant going elbow deep in the guts of the cosmos and figuring it all out for yourself without much help from me. And after seeing the handiwork of the old gods, can you blame me? The creation game needs new blood. Well, enough talk. Let's see what you got. Oh, wow. So we have another chapter to go to Creator Tools. Man, that monologue was tiresome. Anyway, next we'll try to take on the Creator Tools, and we'll see where this goes. Anyway, if you guys enjoyed the episode, please hit the thumbs up. If you guys... Want to see more of the Magic Circle or anything else we got going on here, please hit that subscribe button. Anyway, until next time, this is Burn.